First and 10 right near midfield. They'll run it to Lemon, and he's hit by Chris Solomona and taken down right there, no gain. Well, you know, Stanford's gonna try to run the football against this Oregon defense, but that's gonna be a tough task. That defense oh, just put on the player and said, hey, you know what? You guys, you be accountable yeah. for it. We'll see how that works out today as Edwards goes back to throw. Here comes the rush, and he goes down back at the 36-yard line. Couldn't get out of that pocket. Chris Solomona, Robbie Valenzuela, and a big play by the Oregon defense. Well, Trent was in the pocket, Joe, but that pocket just started collapsing. As you watch, and Trent's staying right here in the pocket. He usually runs now, but right here, there's nowhere to run. They did a nice job of containing him, keeping him in the pocket, and, and, and collapsing from the inside and outside. Running back. Justin just I hate it. I love when we play the small guy. Total yards, you see Oregon dominating the total yardage area. Edwards now, and Haloti not it, just goes through his man for the sack. Second sack of the day, back to the 43-yard line. That's that power of Haloti Nada, 345 pounds of power, of mass, just pushing his lineman right in front of him. In fact, he beats the lineman, and it just throws the running back oh. out of the way like he's a child and gets oh the sack. goodness. I mean, they have no business having a running back trying to help out on Haloti Nada. It's not going to work. Boy, hello team. Seven tackles in the third quarter last week Coming with Arizona. Bench. They'll show a blitz, now they'll back out of it and they'll run the ball. Lemon has nowhere to go as Haloti Nada wraps him up. Chris Solomona there as well. Well, I can see Oregon stacking up against the run. Gonna make this backup quarterback beat you. Loss, loss of two on the play. When, when you run to Haloti Nada's side, it's, it's, this is what's gonna happen, nine times out of 10. Ready. He's been about all the offense so far. Now they'll run the football. Kenneth Tolan, Chris Solomona. On the stop, Anthony Trucks there as well. Boy, an Oregon Stanford game, three to three, with five minutes to go in the second quarter. People are surprised. Likely to return. Deep we'll see, battle. Though. Here comes the blitz, and they're gonna run the football. Not much there, and Cardinal will punt from their 25 yard line. Nice job by the Oregon defense of playing smart football. They let them come out a little bit to at least to the 35 yard line, but they held them. You get the feeling, Anthony, watching the game that a Oregon could short score two than touchdowns. Third and long. So first and ten at the 14-yard line, tenth play of the drive. Ostender's going to throw plenty of time, and now ducks under one guy, and now he's going to go down at the 20-yard line. Marcus progress to the 17 as Halote, I believe, threw him down. Chris Solomona in there. It's a sixth sack of the game. TC does a nice job of avoiding the rush. I tell you, there's a lot of pressure coming up the middle. He's going to try to go to his right, doing a little ducking action. See what I mean about the ball? Just around, and you keep expecting the ball is going to come out at some point, but he's been able to hold on to it. Duck's going to try and do it with four guys, and they do this time, but he gets away. No, he doesn't. I'm not sure officially if it's going to be a sack. Depends where they spot it. They'll spot it back at the 40 seven yard line so it is a sack and it's the eighth sack of the day for Oregon. On well, that last play the Ducks they sent one linebacker which is which is fine you got four defensive linemen rushing the quarterback and a linebacker. And no maybe not there was it was just a four man rush. Chris Solomon on a little delay kind of scouting him out there and it'll be second down and 12 play action again wide open. Smith catches it and goes out of bounds after a two-yard game.